Hey guys, how are you? I hope you're doing okay. Thank you so much for being an amazing Pin Party Club subscriber. I love you so much. Um, I love, love, love making these boxes. It makes me so happy and I hope that you love them almost as much as I love making them. So guys, okay, today I'm going to do a really quick, because it's super simple, how-to video. Um, to be honest, you don't really need a video because you're really smart and it's really easy to do. But I thought you can never explain things too much. Um, I'm very much a visual person, not so much with the wordy words. So I thought, and um, when I was writing the instructions, I thought, do you know what? I'm just going to do a video so there's absolutely no doubt. Um, and I just like chatting to you on video because it's fun. So anyway, okay, so guys, spoiler, spoiler, spoiler. Please look away if you haven't got your box yet or you don't want to see a spoiler. I'm not going to show you the enamel pin. I am going to show you something that is in your box and just how to pop it together. Um, so yeah guys, spoiler, you have been warned. Okay, so in your box you will receive this little postcard um, which is the Baby Animal Birthday Party uh, oh. <laughs> Baby Animal Birthday Party Party Straw Toppers. Bit of a tongue twister there. Um, okay, so what you have is you have these four little um, super cute baby animals um, and they're saying different things and you can make them into straw toppers should you wish with your handily supplied in your box um, paper straws. Okay, so guys, um, so there's four here and what you could do is you could save these for a party, have some people around, have a cute animal straw topper or... Uh, Sorry, I was going to swear then, but I remembered I don't swear in these videos. Um, or um, ignore all that and you could just make them from yourself and drink a smoothie in bed, um, which is what I'm going to do in your dressing gown. Um, why not? That's the best way to have a baby animal, um, a baby animal birthday party, in my opinion. Okay, guys, so what you got to do, <laughs> honestly, it's so straightforward. Probably didn't need to do a video for this. But here we are, never mind. Um, so carefully cut around um, your straw toppers. Um, maybe you can't see in the video, but there is a little dotted line. So super simple. Um, my favourite one, here's one I made earlier, um, is the little piggy that says, I'm kind of a big deal. Okay, so you get home and then you decide what colour straw you want to match him with. Um, I think I want to go for the red straw because um, I quite like that colour combination. And then what you want to do is get a little bit of oh, sellotape. Um, other brands are available. Um, just cut off a little bit of sellotape. It's actually way too much. So I'm going to cut it down into a thin strip. Do, 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 there we go. Oh, I'm being very noisy. Um, okay, so... What you want to do is decide where you want to put your piggy on the straw. Um, so I'm going to put him kind of there. I think that's about right. And then I'm just going to pop... Oh, I realise you can't see. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to pop the sellotape over there um, and over the other side of the straw. And then I have made it a little bit too long, so I'm just going to trim it. Oh. God, it's a good job I'm not a Blue Peter presenter because, guys, I would not be good at this. Oh. Um, cool, yeah, so just pop that sellotape on there and there you have it guys. Honestly, I told you it was so simple. Um, you have your baby animal party straw topper um, and then you can have a lovely drink with him and isn't that super fun? Um, guys, I really want to see what you end up doing with these. Um, so please do show me, please like tag me on Instagram um, or send me a message and let me know and let me know which one's your favourite as well. So. We have um, the piggy, which is my favourite, um, which is the I'm kind of a big deal piggy. Um, and then we have the little cow, um, which says, uh, feed me cake. Guys, someone messaged me and they were like, Anita, why does the cow um, have horns, making it a male cow, um, and also have an udder, making it a female cow? And I was like, why would you gender the cow? Surely the cow can be anything he, she wants to be. Um, <laughs> it's totally not that I got confused when I was drawing it. No, I think she, he looks really cool. Um, 
And then we have a little baby elephant here, um, a very wrinkly baby elephant with a bit of a chubby belly like me. Um, and she says, please leave by 9 p.m. And then we have a little baby octopus here as well. He says, I didn't want to come, which is probably my second favorite one. So I've cut her out. Um, and I think I'm gonna attach her to the green straw um, and maybe have some pink lemonade later with her. <laughs> um cool guys so that is it like super super simple um so i really hope you like um these and the other things that are in your box guys i'm so excited um oh yeah so as you are watching this um you have received your box or you're not worried about spoilers so i can talk to you um guys because i love the card that's in the box i just really love it um but as i make this video the boxes have not gone out yet well they have gone out but I'm making this video like the evening that I've posted them. So no one's received their box yet. Um, so I haven't seen your reactions, but I really, really hope you like it. And I'm really excited for you to see. Let me know. Um, okay, thank you so much for watching and we will speak soon.